Well, hello there, my darlings. Happy Witness Day to all of you and welcome to the final part of the Hocus Pocus build. We are completing this cottage today. We've got three bedrooms left to furnish, so it's probably going to be quite a short part, to be honest with you. Um, and just put some final details, to be honest. I wish I squeezed this all into the last one, to be honest. Um, because we haven't really got much to do. And we're just going to do the three bedrooms today. That's what we're going to do. We are. I'm wearing a hat today because my hair looks like utter shit. Um, and I'm doing a haircut. And I went out for lunch with my friend Elliot and I had a hat on. And I was like, do you know what? I'm just going to wear it in my video. I wear a hat nearly every day. Why not flop one on for a video? Why am I explaining why I'm wearing a hat? No idea. But I am. I am indeed. Anyway, let's flop on over and let's get this build complete. Okay, my absolute dear. So here we are. We are back at the Hocus Pocus Cottage. Um, if you remember last time, we did all of this area down here last time. And I really enjoy how it looks. Very much enjoy how it looks. Um, I just think it looks cute. I had to change the um, candle, though. It just wasn't working on that pedestal. It kept um, disappearing out the bloody cottage for some reason. No idea why. So I just had to put it on that table instead of doing that little thing that we did last time. But everything else has stayed as, it's, as it was in the last part. So today, what we're doing is are the three bedrooms. I thought... Sarah and Mary could have this, these two smaller bedrooms and then Winifred could have the bit more of the bigger bedroom. Now we're going to try and fit in with these kind of colour themes as well. A bit more orange in here, a bit more green in here and a bit more red in here. Just so we can have some kind of like personalities, you know, kind of flying off the um, colour scheme in here. <laughs> uh, no idea, no idea. I'm in a bit of a weird mood. I've had a coffee so I'm off my fucking tits. And um... Yeah, let's go. Let's go. Everyone, go. <laughs> Calm yourself down, Aiden. Calm yourself down. Oh, for goodness sake. Um, I think we'll start on Winifred's room. We'll start on Winifred's bedroom. So, have we got doors in here? We do. We have doors in here. It's fine. I do want to get some wardrobes in here. I'm probably going to go for the um Realm of Magic numbers in here, maybe. 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 Or we could go for a bit more of like a vampy vibe with like these kind of like looks you know and even though the swatches might look a little bit odd in here and it's a little bit too nice to be honest with you this is supposed to be a bit more of a not a dilapidated build but a bit more of an older looking build and i think we're going to very much struggle with a lot of that now i think winifred likes to look nice i think they all like to look nice these little dresses could work in each of the bedrooms to be honest with you um, but I think we'll just flop one. We'll flop one in Winifred's. Let's go over in this corner here. Now, the lighting is a little bit off in here. I might flop in a little sconce on the corner here just so it brightens this room up a little bit. Oh, yes. I oh, know that. In fact, there's no bloody lighting in any of them. Oh, no, there is. There are some sconces. Oh, we've got two there as well. I'm not going to do any overhead lighting in here. I still want this to be kind of moodily lit, I think. Um, do I want to use this? I don't like that colorway. Isn't there like a darker... Nah, I don't think that's going to work. That works. That works really nicely in this room, I think. So I think we'll do that. We'll do this one. And this is where Winifred gets ready. Gets ready, gets her slap on. Maybe, like, I'll put a bar stool next to it as well. Just so it looks like she could sit down and um, do a maquillage on it. Oh, what about you? Because we're going for a bit of a red theme. Yes! We'll flop that one into place there. I'll shuffle it along to the corner and tilt it as well. So the Sims should still be able to get in and use that quite easily yes that's nice oh yes that is cutting in slightly there though let me whiffle that out a little bit more beautiful how are you lot doing today i hope you're doing well i really do um i'm doing very well very well indeed now tonight on twitch if you do want to join me 7 p.m and gmt i'm playing a new building game called hotel Ma magnate or magnate i don't know i don't know how to pronounce it hotel magnate um it's like a hotel building game where you have to like sort of like manage a hotel and it looks quite interesting so i'm playing that tonight on twitch if you want to come along and join us 7 p.m gmt but if you don't as i always say don't bother <laughs> why am i this way no idea scales i don't know why but I think it maybe she could do like a little bit of potion work or something up here as well. Yeah, let's do that. Can I get out some potions? Have I got debug on? I don't think I have debug because I just turned it off. I literally just remembered. <laughs> um, maybe if I go into realm of magic, 
we can have them flopping about the place then. Uh, can I just do a show all moment? Oh, here we are. Look, here we are. And then the potions should come into view. Um, where are they? Oh, there they are. Okay. Oh, yeah. Maybe a love potion. Masterful insults. Where's the love potion? <gasps> Alluring aura. That could be a good vibe. Yes. A little bit of alluring aura in this room. Oh, I'm feeling that. Maybe a nice candle up here as well. Maybe a nice candle. The makeup tray might like a little bit too um, modern for in here. So I don't think I'm going to do that. I think we will, however. Get rid of Realm of Magic and we'll do a little candle moment up here too. Oh god. Oh, there we go. Lovely. Um, lighting. Candle. Oh, ignore. Look at my UI. All the mods are broken again because of the Sims update. Um, so you'll have to excuse my um <laughs> jumbled up UI. I'm like, I don't know where anything is on that, to be honest with you. Um, do I want to do this one? Can I have some red candles? Oh, we can. We can have some red candles. That might look nice actually in this. Oh, it does. Yes. We'll do a few of these there. Can I move that potion along one now? Nope, because that... Um, I'm going to, though, because it's going to piss me off else. Uh, I'm going to flop you to about there, maybe. Let me just see if I can whiffle that into shape there. I mean, that's further along than it was, but it's fine. Yes, that's a bit better. That's a bit better indeed. I do like that. I do like that indeed. Uh, I think, for some reason, I want to put a broom down the side there. I don't know why. So let's um, I drop that one that's down by the door, wherever the door is. There we are. And then I can use one tucked into that little moment in there. I don't know why. Maybe not in that colour, though. Maybe we can go a little bit more darker with it. Oh, sorry. I just booped me mic. Yeah, if we'll go for the orange. No, not the orange one. That's a bit too bit too kitschy. Even though this house is slightly kitschy. That's just not the vibe for me. Yeah, that's cute. Like that. Little rug underneath of here as well, I think. Um... In fact, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to use that rug of dreams that I use everywhere because I know that it's got a red tone on it and size it down for this room. I might even like just tilt it under the bed like this. Have I used this downstairs as well? I think I might have. Of course I did. Oh, no. Oh, well, there is another red one, isn't it? But is that one there? In... Did you hear blue then? Oh, he's very pissed off at something. Mm, that's not the vibe either. Let me find a nice rug. Now, that's the best out of a bad bunch, to be honest with you, to go in this room. So I'm going to use this one. It's slightly adds techie kind of like vibes going through it. But we're going to use it anyway. We're going to use it because we're very limited. Very limited indeed. Uh, so I do want to do like a little wooden table here. Maybe something slightly uh, older looking. Um, oh, no, that's a bit too shiny. <laughs> a bit too shiny, that. Maybe I could use like one of these instead and size this down. Yeah, I think we'll use one of these. I'm going to size it down though. Put it next to the table there. Put it on next to the table. Yeah, I'm kind of feeling that, I think. Kind of feeling that and I do need to put a lamp on it. So I'm going to find a lamp and then move it down with a tool mod. There we go. We'll use that candelabra from the vampire pack, I think it's from. Yes, from the Sims 4 Vampires. I just think it suits this room. I am, however, going to... Excuse you. Dim this room down now because it's looking slightly too bright. Yeah, that's a bit better. That's a bit more colder and for that. Now, I do want a spooky jokey portrait in here as well. So maybe if I use one of these ones and put this in the room. Uh, where can we flop this? Or should I put it like above the bed? Oh, that looks quite nice above the bed, actually. Yeah, we'll flop that above the bed there. Lock that above the bed and I think I'm going to do some kind of like green kind of like splat on the wall in here just to bring a bit of a bit of colour. A bit of colour to the wall even though it is green and mouldy. We're going to flop it in I think. We'll flop one like there. Yes, just to make this room look a little bit more damp. Oh my god, this camera. I hate it. I know you know that I hate it but I'd like to just reiterate the fact at how much I do hate it. And it is a lot. Yes, it is. Right, let's flop you over into that corner as well. Yeah, just a couple of splats up on the wall there. A couple of splats up on the wall. I'm going to do a little chest down at the bottom here. I think that would be in storage, wouldn't it? I'm going to do a little chest down at the bottom here. Maybe like one of these ones. Can we have a little look around? Yeah, that's what we kind of got, really. Yeah, I'm going to do a little chest moment down here. 
like that. Maybe that can be full of some like spell books and stuff. So if that's the case, let me um I drop this one and see if I can get some spell books just for the outside. And I can maybe just put them. Yeah, I could just put them to the side here. Like books she hasn't just read yet. Forced friendship. Maybe that's why her sisters love her so much. Because it's forced. Um, that is slightly floating, but it's magic. Shh. Shush. 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 Uh, and we'll get some scratches up on the wall as well, I think, around here. Yeah, just for some texture. Just for some texture around there. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful. And I think just to finish off this room, a little armchair or something in this room. And I think that would be it. These are not going to be the most exciting of bedrooms. I will say that. Um, but they're bedrooms nonetheless. And that means the build's finished, you know. Uh, I've had fun with this build. I, I, I have I have had fun with this build. But I'm ready, as always, to move on. I'm looking forward to getting back into Design Me Devon. We haven't, we've left that for a long while, haven't we? So I'm looking forward to getting back into that series again. Um, oh, I need a red chair, but I don't want it to be too red. Do you know what I mean? So let me find a perfect red. We'll go for this one from Realm of Magic. That's the only red. I looked through a lot of them then. This is the only red that kind of looks semi-okay in this room. Um, and the style kind of fits in quite nicely as well. Um, yeah, we'll flop you. In fact, I'm going to flop you to there. Turn you in that way. Do a small little side table off to the side. Um... Good luck with finding that. I think actually what I'm going to do is use that stool instead. I use that stool there. And then I'm going to put a little pile of books on top of that. Um, in fact, just use them. Just use the two of those and flop that up to there if it will. Is it floating? Oh, it's floating. Magic! No, I'll move it down. There we go. Move down into submission just a cute little bedroom for Winifred I think she would be very happy with that place I think she would be very happy with that space do you know what I'm I'm thinking about putting the painting there instead I think I'm gonna put that portrait up there instead yeah yeah we'll put it there it just fills that space a bit better then yeah I'm into it I am however gonna move that green into there a little bit more oh beautiful okay right I think Sarah's bedroom may be green a little bit more green. A little bit more... Oh, God, I can't put the bed there. The door's there, Aiden. Oh, where are we going to put this bed then? This is going to be a bit difficult. I'm probably going to have to just put it along the window there, like that. But then where are we going to put furniture in here? Can I move this door? I mean, I could. I could move the door there, to be honest. Let me um. not get rid of all of that door frame. Can I move you a little bit along there? Maybe change the way it opens. There we go. Yeah, so those doors are not too crowded there. Um, and then I can put the bed in this corner then. Um, can we go around here? Lovely. Lovely. Stunning. Oh, I'm for it. I think I'm going to use the same dresser in here as well, to be honest with you. I reckon Sarah likes a little bit of um, maquillage and whatnot. Maybe I could lighten this up slightly, though, just so it looks a little bit more... I don't know. Je ne sais quoi bien. Um... No, no, I think we should just stick with what we had, to be honest. We'll go for that one. That one's got a little bit more of a pale top. It kind of blends in with the white on the bed as well. We'll go for that one there. Why not? And I'm going to use this dresser, this base game dresser. I reckon Sarah would probably be the one that likes a little bit more of an outfit change anyway, com compared to the rest of them. Um, So that's what we're going to do. We're just going to pretend that she likes to look at... Well, she was the one who, get, who seemed to... um get all the men's all the men kind of liked um sarah i remember that bus driver um when they all got on that bus that what is this contraption <laughs> um so i think i'm going to use that one instead i'm going to turn that one slightly in that way lovely oh yes and maybe some flowers in here i'm feeling flowers maybe that one from um this one here from cottage living a bit of pink Oh, no, this would look nice next to the mirror. But yeah, but a little bit of... What have we got going on here? We've got green. Green and pink look nice together. Let's do a little bit of pink in here. Oh, I'm for that. And she does like to look at herself. So I reckon I'm going to flop this one up to here instead. Oh, no, that's kind of took away all the light over this side then. 
Uh, I do want to get like a full length mirror in here somewhere. Maybe by the window we could do that. So let's have a nice little full, full length mirror. Ooh, I could go for this kind of vibe and get some grey going on. Considering we've got the grey on the bed there. Ooh, this could be a vibe. This could be a nice little vibe. No, that just looks weird there. I want to put it there. I think that would be the perfect spot for it. Like there. Do you know what I mean? So I am gonna I'm gonna move this along maybe. Let me see this. No, because I can't see what I'm doing there. Um maybe we do need to put two of these in this room as well. I'll put one above there like that. And then I'm gonna do one one above the bed too. Hopefully that's at the same height. Let me just see this. That one's a little bit lower, so we need to whiffle this one up a bit higher. Stunning. And then I'm gonna get this into a better position. Let's tuck you in there without going into the wall. Um, oh, that's that that's as best as we can do if we want it tilted. There we go. Is that going in anywhere? No, it's not. Yes. Yes, that's nice. I do like that. I do. Oh, very much so. Maybe some perfumes. Can I just type in perfume and things will show up? Perfume. Let's have a little look. See what we've got going on here. Mm, yeah, maybe something like that. Oh, I can see that. Yes, I'm for that. Very much for that. Uh, and then on top here, what could we put up there? Let me find something. Just a little menagerie of objects, loves. A couple of sweets, because she's sweetness and light. Burnt out candle, crystal ball, and one of those like silhouette kind of like weird things. We're going to put that there. Yes, we are indeed. Um, it's a shame that we've got a lot of pink going on in here. I'm wondering if I could do a little bit more of pink with the bed. I like these beds in this place, but I'm just wondering, can we use a bit more of a pinker bed in here? I'm going to have a little gander through and see if we can have a vibe that would kind of suit this room. The only problem is that a lot of these beds do look not... Um, no, that's just it's just not the right pink. I'm thinking more dusty rose kind of colour. I don't think we're going to find that vibe. I think we're just going to have to stick with the one that we've got, to be honest. Because that... Oh God. No, no, we'll just stick with that one. Uh, I think we're going to have to pull a bit more green in this room, though, to be honest. There we go. Slight little scheme change. Made it a little bit more pinker. Um, put some portraits up on the wall. A little chair in the corner here. Uh, and I just think it, I think it suits. It suits, it will do. And that is the most important thing, isn't it, to be honest? Yes, it is. Anyway, we're going to move on to... Um, Mary's room now so I might do Mary's kind of a bit more of a green vibe going on um so they've got kind of conflicting colors a bit more red a bit more pink a bit more green I think we're gonna do that the only problem with that I hate the gray I've looked through all the beds as well and this is the only decent bed that kind of matches in with this vibe we'll get out of that pink moment we've got going on there unless I try and use like one of the base game ones like this one it just looks a little bit too modern. Everything looks a little bit too modern for this house. Um, I mean, that one there's not too bad. Not too bad. I would love some more period furniture. I really would. I've been saying for years now, I want to see some like decade packs, decade game packs, or even stuff packs. I'd love to see some decade stuff packs with like a couple of ounces of gameplay. And can you imagine like a 1920s, 1930s, and then maybe a 60s one, um, 70s and 80s. I would love to see that kind of vibe coming through with furniture and stuff. But we just don't have enough, loves. We don't have enough. That bed was not the right one that I was just looking at, that base game one. Unless I use one of these. I mean, what colours is this coming? I think it comes in gopping colours though, doesn't it? Uh, uh. It's just nothing that's going to suit their personalities, really. I think I'm going to use that one. Maybe that one there. Just a bit more of a darker green vibe in here. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, I think we should. <laughs> Mary gets the best bed out of a lot of them. Um, how much was that bloody bed? It's like 8,500 simoleons. Well, only the best for Mary because Mary's the cutest out of all of them. So, moving on. So, I do. I can fit in a bedside table here. So, we, need, we probably need to stick with the dark browns in this room as well, to be honest with you. So, I think I'm going to use the same one as what I did over there, too. I'm going to go for the dark brown version there. 
also the dark brown um makeup table or dresser that they can because she can get her clothes out of gonna flop this one i'm gonna give her oh i want to give her a rocking chair but i just know that the chairs the swatches on the rocking chairs just make me angry to be honest more than anything i mean we can do a black one in here i mean we can't do like that do you know what i mean like not me sideways with a rusty spoon like and people say why don't you like the knitting pack <sighs> tell you why the swatches are disgusting. That's why. <laughs> I just don't like the aesthetic of it. Such a shame as well because rocking chairs are so cool. I hope we get like some maybe base game ones or something. Or I don't know. The animation is in, in the game now. Just give it to everybody for free. <laughs> uh, anyway, moving on. So Mary, channeling Mary. She's a bit more fun, isn't she? She's a bit more fun than the rest of them. Um... She likes a bit of a dance. Maybe I'll give her like a little old gramophone. Well, we haven't got an old gramophone, but it kind of looks like it. Ignore the iPad that's on top of it. Maybe we can give her a little bit of music. A little bit of music. iPod. Do they even still sell iPods? I don't know. I would not know. I would love to find my old iPod and listen to some of the music choices that's on it. I bet they're bloody disgusting. I bet they're bloody disgusting. Maybe we should give her some flowers as well. We'll go for a green little like vibe in here as well. Yes. Even though that is a bit more of a brighter green. Isn't this fun, isn't it? It's not as fun as what Mary's room could be. But this is what I'm going for. This is what I'm going for. I'm going to put some of these. Oh, next to the bed. Not in red though. Can we change this color? Oh, it's green. Oh, yes. Some green candles. Let's um, move this down slightly. Elevation, uh, maybe a 0 0.07. See what happens there. Oh, I forgot to um, put the minus on. Oh, for God's sake. Um, Undo. There we go. And let's go back. Elevation. Minus 0 0.08. Because that didn't look as far as well. Oh my God, I didn't do the minus again. And I'm pressing toggle group again. What am I doing? Let me get this sorted. There we go. We've finally got some candles in the room. Bloody hell. Bloody hell. That was very annoying then. Um, minus 0 0.1 that was. And I actually put the minus in this time as well. I know. Shocking. Anyway. So. What, para what paranormal paintings? I think it was all like. Um, let's have a little look anyway. Yeah. It was all like. Oh. This could be a vibe in here. Oh, this could be a vibe for her. Maybe slightly darker, though. I know there's a darker aesthetic. Yeah, that's nice. Maybe something a little bit more like that for Mary. Yeah, I like that. That's cute. She's got a rocking chair. Maybe some knitting stuff. Maybe some knitting. Knitting. No? What, what will you be classed as, then? Something stupid. Knit. Let me try that. No. No. We'll just use this. I use this little light object and I'll put it just down on the object and I'll just put it down on the floor. Maybe like, no, not there. Yeah, out in the middle of the room. Yeah. So she's a little bit crafty, a little bit of fun, you know. Uh, and a nice rug. I mean, what ones have we got going on here? Oh, let's see that. Uh, no, that's a that looks a little bit weird in here. Um, we definitely need a green rug in this room though. So let me... um. Find a green rug. Yeah, we're going to go for this base game one. I'm going to size it down though, I think. And like, maybe like put it at a bit of an angle in the room. No, I don't like that. Off to the side of the bed. No, I kind of want it in the middle of the room. Like, oh, there we go. That's a nice spot. Yeah, round about there. Oh yes, Mary would be happy with that. She definitely would. Okay, I think I'm done. I think I'm done with this build now. Yes. Okay, so let's have a little tour, shall we? Let's have a little tour. Let's get some good lighting on the go. Let's have a little tour. In fact, let's go into that. What's the lighting like here? Oh, let's change the time. We're going to change the time to maybe six o'clock. Six o'clock in the evening? No. Um, maybe eight o'clock. We'll change it to eight o'clock. There we go. Yeah, that's a bit better. No, it's not. <laughs> it's not. What time is it here? Twelve? What do you want about? I changed you. Oh, no, maybe this isn't working yet. 
Oh, oh God, and no, that's too light. Oh, they're all going to die. Look at them. They're on the period and everything. Oh, the company shut the water off. Oh, it's all going on, loves. All going on. What about... Oh, does that mean all my... Electricity is off in the room. No, it's fine. It's fine. Oh, God. They're all, they're all being mean to each other and everything. Bloody hell. That's just going to have to do. There we are. Lovely jubbly at the Sanderson Sisters Cottage. Cottage. Um... Yeah, it's cute. I do like it. I do like the way I love the animation on that wheel. I think that looks so cute. Very cute indeed. A little standing stone circle. A little well going around the back here. We've got some flying broomsticks. The back of the build. Oh God, is it speeding up? Oh, we're just going to mute it. There we go. Um, the outhouse that I've covered in green as well. Um, and it's got, yeah, everything they would need to poo pee and wash themselves. Um, let's go in through this way. I'm not going to go. What the fucking hell's going on here? Really? Oh my God, it was all going on. We've got the repo man coming in to try and nick all my stuff. We didn't pay bills. There's a bloody mailbox underneath the tree there. Why is it? <laughs> this is, this is a nightmare. I'm looking forward to letting go of this build. I won't lie. <laughs> looking forward to it. Anyway, in here, Sarah's just about to absolutely piss herself. Um, the candles have burnt down to <laughs> to a puddle there as well which is great um so this is the inside i do like the way it looks i must admit i do like the way that it looks in here got a little kitchen moment over on this side <laughs> oh god the amount of things that went wrong then that was so awful um little living room area over on this part too uh then you come up the windy stairs da 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 and you've got that big overlook down in with those cages where they trapped the um those boys in and then obviously we've got the bedrooms that we've just done uh mary's little green number beautiful we've got sarah's little kind of bit more but oh what are you doing in here oh what's she doing in here we've got sarah's little bedroom in here as well they all look very tired uh and then we've got winifred's little bedroom here as well if you want to see a little like floor plan of it i will put the floor plan up now for you so there we go and then down onto that level as well and this build will be off in the gallery. Um, hopefully, I'll be able to um, fix my UI as well for next time. Anyway, I'm going to go now. I'm going to leave you in the screen. I'll be back tomorrow with Malfoy Manor. Thank you so much for watching, my darlings. See you soon.